In this tutorial, you're going to learn how to animate a chart in PowerPoint. So the first thing I've done here is I've selected the slide and I've added in my chart. And what you have the ability to do is to animate the chart. So the first thing you're going to do is click on the chart area and it's going to allow you the opportunity to click on the animations tab. In this particular case, you'll have to hover over each one of these animations until you find one that you're interested in using. And so in this case, I'm going to select Float In. And by doing that, the next thing I'm going to do is select Effect Options because you notice that the entire chart floated in. But what I can do is say if I want the chart to float down, I also have the ability to say if I want the chart to float in, going in an upward direction. And then the second part of that is I can change the way it reveals itself in terms of the chart and its elements. So the first thing is I can hover over Series and I can see what that looks like. I can hover over category, I can see what that looks like. I can do the same with element in series and element in category. But in my case, what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose by element in series. And with that, I notice that I get this entire area uh, with like 10 showing that it has 10 animated effects. So the first one actually lets you know that if you were to go in and play, let's say you want to preview what's going on with your chart, you can click on preview so you can see what those animations look like. And if it just so happens that you're seeing the preview take place and you don't like what you see, you can actually change this because this really tells you the effects that you're having uh, coming on. And in my case, it's 1 through 10. The first effect is the one that's taken care of for the whole chart. So. I want to remove the effects or the animations from this entire chart. So what I'm going to do is choose number one and I'm going to select none. And then that way the focus can actually be on the animation for these series. So at this particular point I want to see what does this particular slide look like. So on my particular keyboard I'm going to press Shift F5 so I can preview this slide. And I'm going to go ahead and play. And you can see that as you're doing your presentation, it's presenting each one of these particular series and it's doing it one by one so that it's easier to follow. And by looking at that, at this point, I've completed the animation and I'm going to press the escape key. But that's all you have to do to animate the elements that you have inside of your chart.